And now a story you saw first on four tonight. Investigators link an explosion at the Cleveland Clinic in Weston to a propane tank. Hundreds of people had to evacuate as flames shot through the roof of the building. CBS 4's Carrie Codd is at the hospital with more. A blast on top of a building under construction at the Cleveland Clinic in Weston shook the buildings around it and shook up patients, employees, and construction workers nearby. Wow, I feel it's scary. We're told it was a 100 pound propane tank that exploded on the roof of a new neurology building. Construction workers had just been on the roof before it blew. Oh! Make sure that's all evacuated. Make sure there's no extension into that structure. They, along with hundreds of others, were evacuated as a thick black smoke from the fire could be seen for miles. The radio transmissions from first responders show the work that went into battling the blaze. Send me an engine by the ER. There's a hydrant there. We're upwind. It was a perfect attack. Firefighters eventually got the fire under control. And that's my job right there. And you felt the tremor. Patient Jenny Hendrickson was waiting to see her doctor when she felt the entire building shake. It felt like an earthquake. You know, until when they come and tell everybody to get out of the building. Others received calls from family members from their hospital beds. It was a really big explosion, and that uh, they didn't tell her anything. The lights went off for a minute, and they closed the doors. So she was upset when she called me. Broward Sheriff Fire Rescue tells us that no one was hurt, and they were able to contain the damage to the roof of the vacant building. Investigators tell us they're still working to determine exactly what caused the explosion on top of that building. We're told that building was almost finished. No word yet on how all this will affect the opening of that building. In Weston, Kerry Cod, CBS 4 News, tonight.